Sports, it's in the game. Score clock calibration. Use the left stick or the D-pad to adjust your screen area for the best gameplay experience. Press the X button to save and continue. Welcome to NHL. For accessibility, I am an expert. This offers standard controls, controls, high difficulty, all super gameplay pre, pre NHL settings. Thank you for setting up your hospitality setting. NHL setting, continue. Hi everybody, welcome to EA Sports coverage of the Stanley Cup Finals. I'm James Sabalski along with Ray Ferraro, ready to bring you all of the Game 1 action. Centers are lined up, official ready to drop the puck. The proverbial line in the sand is drawn at center ice and we are underway. And there's the save. There's the whistle as the goalie hangs on. James Sabalski, Ray Ferraro with you here in the early going of this period. The game is still scoreless. Back underway, and they take possession here inside the offensive zone. Made the save on the play. Oh, turns it aside once again. Yeah, he's pretty good positioning here, James. He makes the two stops back to back. Palat's going to play it from the back of the cage. The Avs take possession in the defensive end. Nice save off the tender's pad. Through center along the wing. Gains the zone from the right side. Here's a shot. That's gloved by Kemper. And play continues here. And he slides it quickly to the car. Oh, you gotta love the effort as he blocks that. Good stop by Vasilevsky. Still lots of time left in the period. Still no score in this one. The Avs win the draw. And that's blocked with the stop. There's another stop. Yeah, the officials caught that hack. Moves the puck into the attacking area. Play is stopped, and here's the official call. and he wins the draw. Gives them nothing in front. That's a really good save. I think the goalie's probably surprised he was dead center and open to shoot that puck. And he stopped that one. Hard hit on the play. Wow, did he ever finish him hard. And when he dropped, he also dropped his stick. Now he's got to collect himself. Looks like a yard sale out there. The Lightning have taken possession of their own end. Look at that hit. Let's get physical. And we'll get a breather here with offside the call. Helms ready for the draws. They will continue to try to kill off this penalty. Colorado's won the draw in the neutral zone. Oh, what a chance, and it goes sideways. Tampa Bay's got it in their own zone. The Chuskins up at the box. The Bolts run out of time on the man advantage. Both sides back to even strength. I like the work the penalty killers did there. The power play at times looked dangerous, but they didn't give up anything. And the power play is now over. Past the midway mark of the frame. Still scoreless in this one. The Abs will go to work here in the offensive zone. Those face-offs after icings are important. Now you've got the puck and they're a little tired. 
Tampa Bay's got it along the wall. The Avs scoop it up along the boards. Oh, look at this. Here they come. They've got numbers. Dismiss that chance. Those bang bang plays are just that. So quick. Puck on the stick, puck off the stick. The goalie's got to be in the right position or they're not going to make that quick save. Stoppage in play as we get an offside. Kadri's got that dogged determination and that's what helps him win those 50-50 battles to retrieve the puck, guys. We call that his no contest zone ability and it's a part of his game his coaches really compliment him on. The Lightning have gained control of the puck in their own zone. There's a firm collision. Colorado's gained possession along the boards. And there's the whistle icing the call. Here in the late goings of the period, we've still got zeros on the board. Puck has dropped and we are back underway. Getting a little physical there with that collision. He's got a step. Huge stop on the breakaway. Oh, you don't get many of these. He's right in on goal, but the goalie's better. And it's a quick pass to Nichuskin. Into the offensive end now. Here's a shot. Stopped by the goaltender. Shooters like to score bar down. Goalies love this. Glove save. Thank you very much. Centers get set as they're ready to drop the puck again. Colorado's won the draw, they'll go to work. And that goes off course off a of body. That's close, James. The goaltender ends up beating the shooter to the post. As that's a, that looks like it's a goal, but it's shut down. Comfer's got the puck and they'll go on the attack. Oh, he stops him with a glove. Great reflexes there. Handles the pass. The Bulls ready to go on the attack. Solid hit on the play. That'll do it for period number one. We'll drop the puck on the second period in just moments. Along with Ray Ferrara between the benches, I'm James Sabolski. Period number two is about to get underway. Still zeros on the board as we are now underway in the second. Ray Ferraro sees the game like very few people do. Ray, what did you make of that first 20 minutes? Tampa Bay's got to look up at that clock and be pretty fortunate that this game is scoreless. They gave the puck away way too much in that first period. Settles things down and gets control of it once again. Colorado's got control of it now from their own end. And they'll keep on playing as icing is waved off. The Bolts gain control of the puck against the wall. Exploring options here inside the defensive zone. And now it's to Stamkos. Oh, he caught him! Did he ever? Head down, right into the train tracks. What a save! He'll probably feel that one tomorrow. Vasilevsky's got the puck and he's going to hang on. Plenty of playing time left in this frame. Still looking for our first goal. Colorado's won the faceoff. Scores! The Avalanche light the lamp! Always good to get the upper hand in a series. They've got the series first goal as they take the lead here in game one. Colorado's defense translates into some offense and they got the lead. Well, when the game's tied, you can't start taking a bunch of unnecessary chances. They've got the lead now and we'll see if they can extend it before the break. Big time stop with the glove. Vasilevsky's been terrific tonight. I mean, I don't know what more they could ask from him in goal. He has been excellent under deluge at times, but his team's in the game because he's been so good. Grabbed along the boards by Nachuskin. 
Colorado's across the blue line. Shot him, and he makes the save. Oh, another great save right there. Look at this attack here in the Ozone. And keeps it out again. Puck scooped up against the wall. Oh, target. Puck scooped up against the glass. Oh, what a save. And there's the whistle as the goaltender will hang on and give his team a breather. Well past the midway mark of this period, 1-0 the score. The Avs win the faceoff. Takes a shot. Oh, and it stays out as he gets a piece of that one. Dishes it to Hagel. And now he tries to get it across to Kalorn. There's a solid collision. He grabs the puck here on the point. And that shot gets caught in traffic. And that carries off a stick. Here's a blast. Denies him with the save. Deflected away. Nice defensive use of the stick there. Tampa Bay's grabbed a hold of the puck. Colorado's going on the attack as they gain the zone. And that's blocked away. Taken by Sorelli. And now it's grabbed by Ruda. And he slides it quickly to Helm. Tampa Bay's got the puck. Gaining momentum along the wing. Moves the puck up to Sturm. And sends it just out of reach. And the puck goes off that debris on the ice. That goes off a twig. Takes a bump but still hangs on to the puck. Along the wing, up the neutral zone. And there's the horn, two down, one more to go. Both teams will get a chance to uh, catch their breath and get ready for a big third period next. Welcome back to EA Sports. The final frame looms here as the officials set to drop the puck on period number three. All right, the puck is dropped on the third and final frame. Breakaway! Well, it's been a fun one here tonight as the third period is underway. Ray, what did you make of the first two periods? The Bulls might be looking for a new script to get back into this game. Hey, here it is. Quit burping the puck up all over the ice. They turn it over and have to chase for so long, they don't have any offense. Well, things should open up for both sides here with a little four-on-four -four action. Puck control is critical on a four-on-four -four as the game is right now. Face-off holds greater importance to me when you're down a man on each side. Stays with it. And that goes off someone in front and doesn't reach the net. Tremendous hit against the wall. Yeah, unless you're the guy carrying the puck. <laughs> man, that's got to hurt. Everybody loved it but him. Colorado's got a hold of it against the wall. Vasilevsky's gonna hang on for a whistle here in the third. Well, there's not much time left here as you get into the final 20 minutes. The game's close. A mistake now would be critical. We're still in the early stages of this period. We got a 1-0 game to this point. Colorado's got it, and they're on the attack. Oh, and he stops that one that was served up with a whole lot of spice. Power play unit puts their hard hats on as they go back to work. This power play almost jumped off the bench as soon as the penalty was called. They want out. They think they're the answer for the one goal deficit. Great burst of speed to come up with it. Oh, and a misfire as that goes right out of the zone. Picked up along the boards by Johnson. Oh, great little takeaway at center. Can't complete the pass as it goes off a stick. The transition game now into full effect as they move across the blue line. 
The ball drop it now. Misses a golden opportunity there. He's going to kick himself after that one, James. I mean, he's right in the slot and misses the net. You don't get many from this position. Now, that thing sounded like a car crash. When those two guys came together, he took the bad end of that hit. Now he needs some help at the bench. Vasilevsky's going to smother it to get a whistle. Can get dangerous if nobody's in control of the puck. Well, that one stung, and he's slow to get himself back together here, James. I want to look at that again. Vasilevsky's a warrior between the pipes, and we've seen him give it his all to make a huge stop when the situation is called for it. His contortionist zone ability is that athleticism to make those big desperation saves, guys. Picked up along the wall by Johnson. Takes the feed from his own end. Takes a shot. Stop with ease. Vasilevsky's on top of that one for a whistle. Little bit of traffic starting to form around the net. Inching closer to the midway mark of this period. The Avs lead it 1-0. Play resumes here as he wins the draw inside the offensive zone. Turn that chance aside. Manson's dangerous in the offensive zone. He's got it now, and he's already got the go-ahead goal. And that goes wide of everything. Well, at least it sounded hard. I mean, the net's been in the same place for 200 years. That's a lot wide. Puck scooped up by Hagel. And some textbook body contact there. They're going to go. Yeah, he jumped in pretty quickly after his teammate got hurt. He wants to defend here. Oh, and he hammers him and sends him down to the ice. That's a clear decision there. The Avs will like to add on to the momentum gained with that fight. The building is really perked up. A wild couple of minutes there, and things have finally cooled down as both teams will settle in for the faceoff. McKinnon's won the draw here in the open ice. Puck picked up by Manson. Hammers one! Off target! Now a quick pass to Rantanen. You'll need more than that to beat him. Slides the pass over to Pallant. Oh, some strong physicality on the play. Now uh, they stayed right on it. Once they start that first one, they just pushed the pace of this. Now they get another. That's bad news for the goalie. He can't read that release, which is all world, and the speed of the shot's too much. The time he finds it, it's in the net. The Avs have now given themselves some breathing room in this third period. They've ground the game down now, James, where they're really in control with that second goal lead. And the traffic neutralizes that threat. Ref blows the whistle as the puck's covered up. Past the midway mark of the frame, James and Ray with you tonight. The Avs have recently taken a two-goal lead. They'd love to build on it. Great save by Vasilevsky. Takes a shot. Uh-uh. Beautiful defensive effort. Moves it quickly over to Rudolph. And that's offside, stopping the play. Killorn's injury has kept him out of the game. I just got word, James, he's not coming back this evening. Thanks for that, Ray. Let's see how the coach rolls with that now. Tampa Bay's won the draw, and they take possession here in the open ice. Puck grabbed by Palat. Tampa Bay's got it along the wall. Oh, a clutch save! McKinnon's able to keep that play rolling. I mean, once he falls, that play should be dead, but he's able to keep the puck moving, and they get a scoring chance. Gains the zone through center. Here's a short pass to McKinnon. From the left side, they enter the attacking zone. Looks to get the puck over to point. Less than a minute to go now here in regulation. Kind of lost control for a second there, but regains possession. In desperate need of a goal here, they've got the extra attacker out. Can't get it to go. Tampa Bay's got a hold of it along the wall. Good stand-up hit on the play. Fires into the empty net. Works it across to Maroon. Here's a shot. Stopped by the goaltender. 
Denies him again. Takes the feed from the goaltender. Crowds on their feet, saluting the... And there it is, the empty net goal. Well, that'll put a bow on this one. A solid performance. And once you punch in that empty net, or everybody can take a little bit of a breath. Moments away from the face-off. Let's get back to the action. Comfort's won the draw here in the neutral zone. Booming shot! Stops it in the box! This one is all over as the final horn sounds. Goaltending the story tonight as they lead in this series. Takes a lot of pressure off everybody in front of the goaltender if he's that good. He throws a shutout on the board. And you don't have to do much offensively to beat that. And a nice tip of the cap from the home team after a job well done. Uh, you give the fans something to cheer about, they'll stay and cheer you on. A nice win at home. Great playoff action tonight for Ray Ferraro. My name is James Sabalski. We'll talk to you next time where the fun will continue.